If you clicked on this video, you were probably looking for a flower farm. I got you covered. And I gotta say, this flower farm is pretty insane. So if you want to learn how to build it, stick around and I'll show you all the details. These are the blocks I'm going to use for this tutorial. Now those iron blocks can be any block you want them to be, so don't stress over that. Okay, so the farm itself should take up exactly this amount of space. It's going to be 17 wide, 9 deep, and it'll be 3 blocks tall. So directly in the center of the rectangle, we're going to place the dispenser. Facing upwards, a observer with the output facing into the dispenser. And then we're going to dig down a couple blocks here so that we can look up and place one more observer in that orientation. Now centered on our dispenser, we're going to create a 9x9 nine nine pad of grass or dirt if you need. Okay, so it should look about like this. Now, if you look underneath the grass pad, you should see our observers and then our dispenser on one side. Whichever side your dispenser is on, go ahead and add one more row of grass, making that a 10 by nine. Now, adding on to the wider sections, so if we're facing the dispenser here, we can add one more row of glass blocks on this end and go to the opposite end and add another row of glass blocks that so now we should have 11 and 12 wide now that the glass is in we can place our pistons and one side is going to be touching the glass like this and then the other side you're going to leave a block space that way this stuff can be pushed to these pistons and then back so now that the pistons are in place place another row of blocks behind those on either side and then cover those with redstone At this point, I'm going to go ahead and fill the dispenser with bone meal. Place a button on one side or the other. We can give it a test. And there we go. That works. And now for the magic, we're going to go ahead and place a note block here. And an observer. Might want to hold shift while you do that. And we're going to do the same thing over here. We're going to have to have a temporary block and then the note block shift and the observer now if you'll come over here and right click on this note block isn't that magic so simple in order to turn this off we're just going to hit this button and most of the time it'll stop here or if it's held down long enough it'll stop on that side which just means whichever side that the glass is touching the pistons that's where you need to start the farm So like in this case, you'll turn it back on over there. Pretty easy, pretty easy to figure out. So this is the output of the farm. Obviously this will vary based on what biome and where you place the farm. And this is just be, you know, random number generator on these flowers. You might get more or less seeds, but pretty much almost a double chest out of nine stacks of bone meal. That's pretty, that's a pretty good rate there. Uh, now let's check and see how much bone meal we get from all these seeds. 171 seeds. Let's see how much of that converts back into bone meal for us. So we got a stack in three. So that's 67 plus the 1629 in flowers makes it 1696 if you don't include the seeds. We did also lose a little bit in the composter there. I don't know. It's pretty good for something so simple. Anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed and found some value in the tutorial, uh, do me a favor, hit the like button. And if you're new around here, subscribe to the channel. But I do have a, a more advanced system here that has a collection system. And if you guys want to know about this, let me know in the comments. We might make a tutorial here if there's enough um, engagement there.